Remember what you made in high school shop class? I bet it didn't get 50 miles to the gallon. These high school auto shop students yeah. from West Philadelphia High School built the car as an after-school project. You're good. High school kids thought of this idea. We're not geniuses, but we, we found technology that's readily available, and we applied it in a unique way. So it's not just high school students from an elite school. We're an inner-city, urban high school, and our kids often are stereotyped as not being able to do something great. And, and we've proven time again and again that if you give our kids something good to do, they step up. In 2002, the West Philly Hybrid Vehicle Team achieved remarkable success, beating out 41 teams from around the world in the National Tour de Seoul. Teams they competed against included production vehicles and top universities. This enormous success helped pave the way for their next accomplishment, something that had never been done before. They created the world's first hybrid supercar. What makes this car so great is that it's very fast. It can accelerate 0 to 60 under 4 seconds, which puts it in the league of a handful of cars in production. Something like a, a Ferrari or a Porsche 911 that's totally souped up. Yet it's getting better gas mileage than 99% of the cars out there. In 2005, the team entered their hybrid supercar on the National Tour de Seoul, and they won again. Governor Pataki of New York presented the first place trophy at the finish line. This generated front page newspaper articles and lots of news coverage. An engineering dream achieved at West Philadelphia High School, students in the school's automotive academy are celebrating the completion of the world's first hybrid supercar. After winning first place and gaining all this attention, what should the team do next? They decided to enter the most challenging competition yet, the Automotive X Prize, which will be held in 2009. Teams from around the world are on the quest to develop the best 100 mile per gallon vehicle and win the grand prize of $10 million. There are over 60 teams entered and only three teams are academic institutions, including Cornell University and West Philadelphia High School.